Hello, Hello Floss Tube. Tube. We're the Real Housewives of Cross Stitch. I'm Priscilla. I'm Chelsea. My God, she's here. We're in the same house. We don't know how to set up the camera anymore. Hello, we're here. Yay! Happy post whatever Valentine's, Valentine's Day. Day early. Cash sent Saint me flowers. St. Patrick's Day. So in other words, his mother sent me flowers. Instacart for the win. I didn't want to get mom sick, so Instacart. Uh, no, actually, we had a doctor's appointment that day. I've spent the week in the doctor's office, not because we're sick, but because of my son and me. We were racing up the stairs. He fell, hurt his elbow. We heard a little pop, so we took him to the urgent care. They took x-rays, and they're like, no fractures, no sprains. You know, just ice it. He's probably just holding it weird. Um, okay, so it was the lady that I yelled at the first time, so maybe that had something to do with it. That was when he had a 106 temperature, and she's like, what are you doing here? And I was like, if you're not going to help me, you know, when Cash said I was frustrated with her. Um, okay, so she's like, yeah, it's fine. Just take it home. Seven days return if nothing's better. The next day, he still couldn't use his arm. I was like, it's not right. So we went to the doctor. Um, up in Oak Creek because ours didn't have any openings. <coughs> they reduced it, re did a reduction because he had, I Googled it, he had um, nursemaid's nurse. elbow. And I was Googling it in the car because he still wanted to go to uh, school because Valentine's Day was happening and his Valentine was going to be there. Um, so we took him after school. The next day he was still babying and I'm like, Internet says it should be better. So we took him to a different urgent care up in, where did we go then? Like an hour away. And she did it again and it, his arm is fine. He's perfect. He's an angel. He got a very expensive Lego set. So we are, we're out of doctors. I have lost faith in all of medical right now. Okay. Urgent care. I'll say urgent care. Because they just make sure you're not dying and then they push you out. All right, go ahead. What'd you do this week? Yes, that was, I stitched. That was my week. <laughs> oh, we went to Texas Roadhouse for and, and summer. And we are going to show you our releases for market today. So it's very exciting. We are also going to show stitching seasons with the housewives. We are going to let you know when we're going to show it. We're going to show it at the end in case you haven't received it yet. We don't want to spoil the surprise. So at the very end, we're going to show it after we talk about giveaways and all of that. So then yep. we'll let you know, Hey, we're going to show that now and you can turn yep. this off for the, the yep. day. But we hope that you stay and join us if you... And so many of you have made such good progress on it. It's like... They've talked about it. They've already stitched half of it. it. Somebody finished it. Um, oh, I, <laughs> I have finished the summer one for the majority. And we, we've heard such nice comments about how much you love it. So yes. Thank you so much. All right. We did have some questions from last week. Uh, Angie, I purchased August through April, month to month. Is it too late to join for May, June, and July? No, this is an ongoing series. Month to month is still going. I think going. she's talking about getting the club from Fat Quarter Shop. I think that there might be a couple openings, but I'm not 100% certain. Well, not certain. for August through April. April. She said, I purchased August through April, month to month. Okay. That's what we have out so far. Okay. And she wants to join for the May, June, July. Yeah, but it's not a club. Uh, month to month isn't a club. It's ongoing. So she might not know that those are still coming out. She's oh, new okay. to the channel. Okay. Uh, Presley, thank you. Barb, I know you all stitch one X at a time, but do you use the loop method or two separate strands? I don't even know what the loop method is. Two separate strands because we stitch totally with classic color works floss. Yes. Um, Marie or Mary, do you have any patterns for babies or grandmas and grandpas? We just found out that we are going to have a new grandbaby. Congratulations. We have the, oh, baby, what's in my cup? It's got a baby coming out of the cup. Mm -hmm. That's the only baby one. Shh. Chris, Stop. have you tried using Velcro to attach your stitches to the backers instead of magnets? Um, it doesn't work. It's not, yeah, no. if you, right, with the amount of backings that we you, do. You, you were, might get through one or two years, but after that, you aren't going to get through any of it. Parker, what? come get your sister, please. <laughs> the dog sister. <laughs> Thank you. That Can one. Just lock them all in there? Yeah. <laughs> Shh, no, you can't lock them anywhere. Hey. Uh, Earlene, stop yelling. <laughs> Earlene, will the Easter Let's Ride a Bike be coming out in PDF format? Yes, that'll be available the first week of 
March, whatever month we're in right now, February. Um, they come out the following month and then month to month they come out uh, about 45 days after we ship. So I give the stores those 45 days to sell. We want um, that to be your first. I've tactic. had the Courtney's all week too. So it's oh, that was it. Five dogs. How, how has it been? <laughs> Sometimes they're a little hard. <laughs> Presley and the little You dealt with five kids, to, so I doubt it. Fight. Yeah, it's just like that. <laughs> Those are the questions that we had this week. Eating time is like a real extravaganza. <laughs> <coughs> I put up bins that because I was taking down my Valentine stuff, and I put up bins to put the corgis on that side of the kitchen so they could eat, <laughs> and the rest of the dogs on this side. I come walking in, and Presley is jumping over the bins. <laughs> she just went and sat on the bins like a big hyena. <laughs> so funny. Anyway. All right. This week in the Etsy shop or previous finishes, whatever you want to do. Okay. We'll do these. All right. So, uh, the spring for February, we did spring roundabout. So the first one was hello spring. Then we had spring home and these are featured on the, uh, pedestals from Paisley's and polka dots. Yes. I was going to do it again. And look at the beaded garland with the watering can. So this is this week's and it's life in full. Oh, you need that on there. Probably life in full bloom. I used that when I was trying to take a picture. I figured. It's a piece of tape. It's so cute and perfect for your tier tray tidbits or perfect for what we're going to show you at the end of the video. And also, <laughs> if you did your calendar crates with the hooks, this is so cute yes. to hang from there. Like if for your March one with all the <laughs> tulips and everything. Right. So she painted this for us, but she provides excellent instructions on how to paint it in mm -hmm. her uh, when she ships it to you. Mm -hmm. Daisy trim is from Hobby Lobby, right? Yes. And that is the mustard, yeah, mustard Chelsea's checks. Yes. Those little flowers are so cute too. Yes. I think we need a whole package of those. All right. For um, <clears throat> decor. Okay, then. Yep, that's first. We have the Dapper Doodads, which is city spring for this wee month. So this is City Spring 1. She did the three layers. So aqua, mustard, and the black and... Okay, it's okay. <laughs> we need... That's what she needs. She needs like an eye patch just over her butt. <laughs> her butt for the video. <laughs> then number two is the umbrellas. And this is uh, so cute with the added on. Mm -hmm. I, don't, I don't know what you would call that, but it's super cute. Uh, so City Spring 2. Kind of like a banner. Then City Spring 3. The clothesline. Super cute. And she painted this again. The, yes, this is a spring house. The, the, the last two that she showed you were new in her shop there for spring. Yes. The other ones are like every day. This was an yeah. every day. So City Spring 3. And then you get the letters in the banner. And I think she's only doing the two spring ones. So... Then you can mix like two regular ones with two spring. Okay. Those okay. were the Dapper Jew Dads. And then I thought I would show you a couple of previous finishes. Oh, Penelope and Peep. This is a What's in My Cup. This was the first What's in My Cup. It's Penelope and Peep. The little chocolate bunny. She stitched on Evening? Yes. Evening Blue. Yes. Rit dyed Evening Blue. Um, I don't know that it was coffee tea dyed after. It doesn't look like it. But she's the cutest little chocolate bunny, so. And she's on just a frame. Mm -hmm. From I think that was from Michael's. Yeah, it doesn't look Long like Hobby Lobby. Just a cute frame. I have seen you guys posting those cute little trims from Dollar General or mm -hmm. Dollar Store. Have you seen those mm -hmm. with the little carrots? Yep. Okay. Oh, I don't know if I saw the carrots. I saw like pom-poms. They're, they're like little carrots. Welcome Spring is featured on a Stitch Etc. block. Super cute. Chelsea's checks. This is another evening. No, this isn't evening blue. This is aquamarine or what's the other color that you use? Mm. Denim. This is that was denim. This is evening blue. Oh, this is denim. This is evening blue. Yeah. This has a little bit greenier tint. Mm hmm. Okay. And this, I think, is the same as this. Yeah. Because they were together, right? Yeah. <clears throat> this was evening. Gertrude. Evening blue. Yeah. Gertrude's garden. Yeah, I couldn't remember which one was which. This is on a house from Scarlet Sky Designs. Yes. So Scarlet Sky Designs TX on Etsy. 
super cute. Reminds me of mom's wheelbarrow out front. Also, I was at Hobby Lobby yesterday and they have these again. We used these last year, but these would be so cute for the roundabouts too. And you can hang them. So you could do like a square backing for it with the circle in the center. Yeah, somebody said she and they're stitched cheap. something and made it a square. These are $5 and then they're 40% off. So five times six, $3. So, are we ready to show them? Oh, I don't know. Are we? <laughs> All right, so we've got some new releases for Market. If you don't know what Market is, we talked about it last week. It's a wholesale shop for um, needlework stores and online stores to come and see some new releases. And Okay, so this is the May month to month. And these flowers, when I saw them, I was like, oh, that, that's perfect. Because this is a bright one. This is that Priscilla's peppermint which is a new color from classic color works super pretty the green is also new and the yellow is um fields of greens and cottage daisies yes is it? very beautiful it is bright mm -hmm. very springy so that will be available at market then the next one is this is my favorite it's the let's go ride a bike and this is for may right May. Is it all stuck on there, right? I'm looking. <laughs> May. So this was through the garden gates. Mm -hmm. It's got a little wheelbarrow with the chickens and the daisies, the egg sign. So cute. So ready for spring. And up here, she put in some faux hydrangea and daisies. Yes. And this is just the daisy garland from Hobby Lobby. And it's, it's really inexpensive when they're on sale for half price. I think they're like $5 maybe. So I just stuffed it in there and, you know, they just kind of fall Flat. out like just whimsical. Okay. <coughs> All right. And number three is the Adorables for spring. Spring bunnies. Mr. and Mrs. Bunny are welcoming you into their house with their carrot wreath on the door and their chicks garland and it's so cute this guy had to be restitched completely as well as from here over <laughs> chelsea stitched that one oh twice all right so this is featured on a house frame from stitch etc so mm -hmm. they have a uh, shop in farmington missouri, missouri or they are do done on facebook stitch mm -hmm. comment etc mm-hmm and you can get one. So that's put on there with magnets and washers. And so is the, the carrots. Okay, now we had to add some Christmas. And what's better than a ticking stripe banner of Mary? It's hard to see. There you go. So I finished these pretty much like the ornament tutorial, except for I didn't do any backing on them. And um, I added like the loopy bow to hang them from. And you can see the stripes. And then I used our ribbons to do the banner, to hang them, and to put on the top. And there's also one of those little um, what are they, bottle brush wreaths on the top of each one. So this will make a... Yeah, make sure all the letters are facing the right way. This will make a great effect for your Christmas decor. And it was so fun to stitch. And it was one of those things that you can take with you. Yep. Okay. So there's number four. <laughs> Sit down. Such a weasel. There is a possible number woo, five. Woo, woo. If I get it done in time. She took the ribbon with her foot. <laughs> we'll, uh, we'll have to see about that. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I got a gift from from Tanya. I wanted the boxes for spring from Target and I couldn't find them. She found them? Yes. So there's that one. There's the carrots. These are so cute to like display your cross stitch on top of. And the fresh Ooh. cut flowers. She also sent me my favorite dove. <laughs> and then I had wanted this garland at 
Valentine's, but I couldn't find it, and she got one, so she sent it to me. But they look like those balls, but they're actually like on me. And she also sent me the little, I'm keeping this wrapped up because I want to put it in my Valentine's box. It was a little car from the Target dollar spot. Oh, cute. My Target dollar spot is really hard to find things at. So thank you so much, Tanya. Ooh. I also got an order from Fat Corner Shop. I have to give Chelsea some of this because she had to give me what she had. Yeah, that, um, that banner is done in all 12 grain and ribbon red. Can we show? Yeah. These are from Kimberly. So she stitched the letter, so V, A. And she bought all these little squares to put them on. So she's gonna have it all lined up. She also sent this to put something on. Okay, this one. Flower market, no. Super cute. Mm -hmm. And our stitches are perfect as always. Mm -hmm. Just like my. I also got two hoodies and the red ribbon set. And of course, some sticky board. Here is the floss. Um. Super pretty. And here's what I'm working on right now. And a lot of you um, had comments about you couldn't find the basket online. If you put in the SKU number, you can't find it. But somebody showed where you put in welcome spring basket and it pops right up. So <laughs> the SKU I was trying to read last week. Is that it? Yeah. Stop. <laughs> You're so mean. <laughs> Can you read it? First she had it like down here. Can you read it? What is it? Okay, we got a gift from uh, I, I, I can see, and I'm going to tell you something really <laughs> funny. So um, the, the girl across the street came and sold me Girl Scout cookies. <laughs> tell me you did not. <laughs> so I filled it out, and I thought it said $5. I gave her $20 for four boxes. <laughs> you thought that poor girl was ripping you off. I, I <laughs> hope you wrote them a letter. I haven't yet because I just found out yesterday. Girl Scout cookies are $6 a box. I owe her $4. I'm giving her five. I'm giving her a little tip. <laughs> she, <laughs> the little girl came in and was like, I, you still owe no, money. No, she didn't say that. She said, you owe me money. And I was like, I gave you money when you were here. I didn't put my glasses on. And you know, the little form thing is really small. <laughs> if the police show up here, I no. Piper's biting me. Because... You better go over there and <laughs> I, save I, I don't want to like ring the doorbell or anything. I'm waiting for them to be outside, and because the kids play outside a lot, so I will give it to her. <laughs> Ripping off Girl Scout. You're not going to watch the Alex Murdoch trial. You're going to be watching Priscilla rip off the Girl Scouts on YouTube. Isn't that bad? Anyway, <laughs> get them glasses. I have lots of glasses, but I didn't have them when I went to the door. How did you not think that prices were going to go up? They were $5 when I was a kid. No, they weren't. They were like $2 <laughs> when you were a kid. So Creative Carol sent us these these little floss folders. They're so cute. This is like my tractor. And that, you can keep that one. And she sent us two new thread keepers. All right, so is this a in new our product? Fabrics. Wait, is this a new product? I'm not sure. I didn't have my glasses. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> but these are so cute in our fabrics with the Chelsea's checks on the inside. So Chelsea will link her shop below. She does such nice work. 
And she sent us a picture. Where's the picture? Oh my gosh, where's the picture? I don't know. Where did you find it? I gave it to you before. Right here. So she sent us a picture of all of our fabrics lined up, and I thought it was so cute. Thank you so much, Carol. I don't know. If, I don't know if it is or not. All right. Well, we can. Well, see. we can just talk about it. I'm and sure if it, it is because it's got our tag on it. But this would be so nice, like if you're going to a retreat and you have your main project in here and you know you might need some extra flosses to just line them up in there and then they're all flat and not stuffed in a bag and then just put this in your project bag. And then put some needles on here. You're all yep. set. Okay, can, give me the floss. Okay, it's fine. You want this one? <coughs> Don't take my floss. Thank you. All right. Then Chelsea will link her shop below. She has an Etsy shop, and she does really nice work. She's really sweet. I swear. Okay, we're... Do I have anything else that we have? I don't know. <laughs> You're hoping not. I got <laughs> seeds. That was my haul. And I got you some. They're somewhere. I don't know. Why'd you find the seeds? You asked for them. Okay, so our question of the day will be which of the four new releases is your favorite but then now chelsea's going to do the giveaways and then after the giveaways we'll show our spring seasons after our, all the giveaways because yeah. we have to go over last week's and then this week's all right so the tidbit to da thank you so much for yes. sharing and participating we so many love nice seeing ones. them yes. 25 dollar gift card to our etsy shop you know how this works you email me and then i email you which patterns you choose kathy collins robin key rex road and debbie penalver congratulations thank you again for participating yes awesome then the i was there post 25 dollars to our etsy as a gift card thank you to everyone who has been here or is just joining yes. us or who <laughs> took a break and came back yes thank you thank you and, thank you, and thank so you. many of you have said that you started stitching after you started watching us and we just love to hear that. Yes. Or re came back to stitching, I should say. Like re entered the yeah. stitching. Yes. Um, I was there. Linda Spost, Carolyn Petrie, and Shay Riddle. Congratulations yes. and thank Congratulations. you so much. We yes. appreciate that you. That was fun. All right. First up was the spring home. So three opportunities to win the PDF. I email it to you. This goes to Darla Allgood, Lena Rowe, and Patty Murphy. Then we had City Spring 2. City Spring 2. That goes to Kim Cannon, Kathy Palmer, and Tina Force. It's like my little mudroom thing was made for these houses to be set up. It's so cute. Why are you looking over there? <laughs> there, there I, don't know. I don't know. Egg Basket goes to Karen Jones and Cecilia Tracy. You just trying to rip off Girl Scouts? <laughs> I can because she made I'm a so deal about it. She's like, I gave them money and they just sent her here and she didn't know that I already gave her money. It's so funny. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> I you need to film that. You need to go over there with an apology letter. <laughs> oh, hello spring, what's in my cup? Where is it? I cannot believe that. Right behind you. And I can't believe you didn't right. tell us that earlier. I know you found out probably two days ago and didn't tell us. You're embarrassed. All right, Hello Spring. <laughs> Hello Spring goes well, to... When, when have I talked to you except for, the, <laughs> to, for medical reports? Yeah, well, it's a lot lately. <laughs> Michelle Faison, Leslie Price, and Mary Kubasek. I'm going to have to watch her when Cash starts selling candy bars or something. <laughs> Buzz of the Bees. Where's Buzz of the Bees? Ooh. In the mudroom. <laughs> in the mudroom. Buzz. I don't see it. Just they can picture it in their minds. It can be a a guess. All right. Well, then we had Peep. I'll go back to Buzz of Bees. Peep. Katrina Doherty, Christy McCain, and Dana Allen. And then back to Buzz of the Bees. Buzz of the Bees goes to Donna Joey Rawlings, Becky Atchison, and Christine Sloat. I kind of did my um, hutch in the oops in the family room with um. I put the farmhouse sign in there and some chicken stuff. Oh, because I took down the winter. I couldn't take it anymore. Garlands <laughs> from pay and then we got a snowstorm. <laughs> 
snowstorm. Paisley's and polka dots. Um, wood teardrop garland goes to Josie Connor and Debbie Abshire. Make sure you put in what you want it and your physical address so I can send it to you. So I have not used this one yet, but <coughs> it's the same round, but it's on the beads. The, the one that I used on the beads was this one and the Valentine one. Then from Pet Quarter Shop, thank you, Kimberly and team. We have a Notions Gar... Um, you try to find it. These are all from Lori Holt. The Prim Village, like, zipper pull. This is a thread ring. And then the, I think there was a needle in there, wasn't it? Oh. There was three things. Yep. And the pink bee needle liner. That's really cute. All right. Thank you, Kimberly and team. That goes to Tana Caddy, Shingle Spring Stitcher, and Tammy Clutie. Then we had the quilt pattern with the dog ear clipper tool. This is Luminary's quilt pattern, and it's absolutely beautiful. That goes to Kim Cloak, Linda Joyner, and Jan Plum Crafts. Then two patterns from Fat Quarter Shop, the January Stackables, super cute, and the take um, the Lady Claws. This goes both. Yep, this goes to Janice Davis, stup Stamp Pendously Shannon, and Adelia Cal Caliandro, Caliandro, Calandreo, Calandreo, sorry. Bountiful bag, beautiful, beautiful. Crystal Colburn and Patty Hinman. Again, thank you, Kimberly. Thank you, Fat Quarter Shop. All right, email me what you want. If it's something I have to ship to you, make sure you include a physical address. If not, make sure that you give me an email address to send it to and what you want. Did you see the person who's stitching this and she said just just reading the words makes yes. you think that you know you need to be thankful for? Yes. Yeah. For, I don't know her exact words, but it was a really nice sentiment. Somebody posted on my thing quite a bit ago that they never miss a sunrise and never miss a sunset. So I've been trying to see everyone now. Just looking out the window at least. Just every sunrise and every sunset. And then... I think I see most of them. Yeah. I miss a few sunrises when I'm working in there because you don't... Mm -hmm. They don't get in there. But I see the sunsets from in there. But just simple things in life that sometimes we take for granted. Yeah. But the sun is always rising and the sun is setting. Especially during that long stretch where we did not see the sun for two weeks and I was going nuts. It was... I think it was longer than two weeks. I feel like it was like three months. You, <laughs> yeah, well, you had longer. I got to get out of here for a little bit. Okay. We also had these to offer as giveaways this week, right? Or these ours? You're positive that we haven't already given them away? And No, it's a Cupid box. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, we're, we always start with these. <laughs> <laughs> Number one for giveaways this is, week. You've already heard first the question. <laughs> You're just flustered because your mother ripped off a is Girl Scout. It, yes, that's a reflection <laughs> on us. Like, Stop. <laughs> I already feel bad enough. You better go over there they're, and give her another 20. Thinking, oh my God, she's seen out. No, I can't see those smiling. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you go over there reading with your glasses on. No, I wouldn't be able to walk with my glasses. <laughs> All right. First one, number one is three. Listen. <laughs> be kind. Good girl. She doesn't like the way you're talking to her mother. <laughs> you're going to be evicted if they come here and the police have to take her away. <laughs> number one is three opportunities to win life in full bloom. Or in full bloom. It's called in, Flu in full bloom. It's available on our Etsy shop. That's number one. Okay. And number two is two opportunities to win the wood piece from Paisley's and Polka Dots. That's not how it goes. Well, we're doing it that way today. <laughs> so that's number two. <laughs> number three is three opportunities to win the <coughs> City Spring 3. Oh, God. Move them further away. <laughs> that's number three. Number four. Number four is three opportunities to win Penelope and Peep. Number five is three opportunities to win Welcome Spring. Is that a, this was a standalone? If it's not, then you'll send it. <laughs> Number five. Number six is three opportunities to win Gertrude's Garden. Okay, and then we have some more of the, those bags. 
Let's number seven is three opportunities to win the bountiful bag. Number eight is three opportunities to win stronger together. Number nine comes with the pattern and the floss, and the bountiful bag comes with the floss box. Yeah, okay. and the fabric. Okay. Number eleven. Two opportunities to win the Cupid box from Fat Quarter Shop. Okay, and then the question that you answer is, which is your favorite of our four new releases? Also, if you didn't get in on the, the club for the spring seasons, I think that if there's any extras that did not get paid for, that they'll be available on either Saturday or Monday. So try then at Fat Quarter Shop to see if you can... So today or Monday. Snag... Yes, Saturday okay. or Monday. See if you can snag one. I'm not sure which day that they were going to open up the the ones that weren't paid for, but there's not very many when we talked to them last, and there might be even less now. So if you can try to get one, that would be your best options because we've seen people asking how they can get one. Yes. Okay. But we when we started this, it was like, when did we start this? I September. Because, but I don't know. Oh, when at the they, wedding. Yeah, yeah. When they opened up. When Kimberly was here, it all got. You guys started stitching on it. So it was done before then. Okay. Yep. All right. Yeah, you're right. Remember, she <laughs> said she stitched it on the up and down. Um, so mom stitched it. You stitched it horizontally. I right? thought hers was the same. Oh. Also, Kimberly's finishing is different from the watering can. Okay, wait. Can we talk about it? Oh, we're going to show it now. So if we're done with the video, thank you so much for joining us. If you don't want to see the stitching seasons because you haven't received it yet and want it to be a surprise. So you can turn us off now. Do you have the whole kit? Maybe we should show that first and then we'll show the finish. Yes. Turn us off now and we will see you next week. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Make sure you like the video, be a subscriber. You know, mom's social. And I, I know that if you live in a different country, you definitely don't have it now. Hi, Claire. So... <laughs> It is coming and they are doing, they yeah. did have a, an ice storm, which delayed it a little bit. So it is coming and we appreciate you waiting and being surprised. So yes. turn us off. See you later. Okay. Three, two, one. Okay. So if you receive the stitching seasons, it came to like this. Super cute. Yes. And then you open it up and you've got this cute little bag. So the bags for each one will be different, and also what she's going to show you will be different. So we've got the Hello Spring. All right. So you've got the piece of thin white pine, pine board. Pine board. The needle. The um. I'm sorry. The the it's a zipper, zipper pull. pull. Zipper pull. It's so cute. So. I used mine on what I'm going to show you, the finishing. Okay. And then you get the floss to stitch it, the chart, and some finishing fabric. Absolutely a beautiful kit. We are so, so happy with it. Mm -hmm. Okay. So that. I just think this pink bag is the cutest. And then the back has our logo and then back quarter shops. But it's just like our Christmas shirts where it's the stitching. That's what we wanted so yes. okay there's yours all right so now the finishing so paisley's and polka dots sent me a picture of this <coughs> item, and i i had bought like five different things to finish this on they might not be able to hear you but this is a ladder shelf and it leans up against the wall it's like a tiered tray, so you can hang your your roundabouts, and then this comes off, and I use magnets to hold it on there. But then you have, let me see this first. So this is the stitching season. So this is what is in your kit. Let them see that up close. And again, this finishing piece is from Paisley's and Polka Dots. And then we, we did the roundabouts this time with all of the, the, you know, the colors. 
But up here, you could put like one of these baskets or something too. Yeah. Because this shelf up here is smaller. Oh, Jesus. This is the second time I hit her in the head. Girl Scouts and poor dogs. Anyway, it's so cute. It sits on the green cabinet in my, my foyer and I just love it. But this is from Paisley's and Polka Dots. I think that they are just on pre-order now. She's supposed to get them in this week. So then they would ship probably, well, you'll have it before spring starts. So, but Kimberly's is finished differently than mine. I purchased an item at Hobby Lobby. And so she'll show you hers on Wednesday. So yep. you can decide which way you'd like to finish it. Yep. But like I said, this is done in with magnets and washers and so I can switch it out for the seasons. Yeah, it's a wood piece that's, you can't really see it. So if there's little eyelet hooks up here. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna take that, hold that. And this has um, a white wood piece. I and added black hangs. checks to the back besides the aqua that comes with the kit. But it would be beautiful with just the white background too if you mm -hmm. wanted to. Super cute. And if you don't like this brown, you could paint it white, you could paint it black, you could paint it any color you wanted. But this little pedestal fits really good down here. And then, of course, any of the beaded garlands you can hang. Yep. So there it is. We are so excited for it. You're going to just put it down on the floor? No, because I Oh, and then it. I forgot to show you. There's my little zipper pull. Yep. Do not eat. Is this for Sif? What is this? No. It's apple blossoms. Don't eat the apple blossoms, <laughs> Eve. <laughs> All right. That is the stitching seasons. We are super excited. Like we said, we've got the summer one almost done. So then we'll start on the next. Mm -hmm. We are really excited about it. And we are thrilled with your participation in it, yes. your excitement about it. Yes. Uh, we really do hope that you love it. We've seen lots of people um, who didn't stitch on 28 count before being yes, able to yes. stitch on 28 count, yes. but the holes are easy to see. So we appreciate you just trusting us and jumping in and yes. starting this project with us. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. All right. So <sighs> if you, if you get your <laughs> finishing inspiration post, tag us, tag my blog. We'd love to see your projects. Follow us on Instagram at Priscilla Delaney at Chelsea356, Priscilla's2000 on Facebook and Priscilla's2000.blogspot.com where you can see more of everything that we do and all of the new releases, more info will be coming on those in the next few days. And so we we can't wait to see all of the shop owners at market and, you know, get their thoughts on the new releases and everything and we're very excited for them so yeah shops will have the information today so they can start a lot of shops do pre-orders for market so you can put those in um so that you're guaranteed a chart when because well especially the market exclusive if your shop isn't going to market that one you'd have to place with somebody going to market because mm -hmm. it's exclusive to market for is it three months three months let's see I think it was just 30 days, wasn't it? Oh, it's they exclusive to market for time. a certain amount of time. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I didn't pay the Girl Scout right, so I can't answer that question. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> okay. See what happens? <laughs> when what? What happens? When you can't pay the Girl Scouts when I'm sick? <laughs> That's what happens? Okay. It's your fault. <laughs> All right, I knew it. It was your fault. <laughs> we appreciate you hanging out with us. Thank you. Um, ooh, thank you for not. Don't forget to tell us your favorite of the four new releases: <coughs> the Mary Ticking Stripe Banner. I got the the month to month May through the garden gates. The let's go ride a bike. May May and sounds like we're goats. Where's May. the where's the um the bunnies? Adorables is right. You had them last. I have it. <laughs> you had them last. I have it. I said. Okay, I'm going to get this one. She's still got the ribbon spool on this thing. You know, it's freshly yeah. finished. Yep. I'm trying to get them turned around. The letters turned around. Well, they, these are, were God. so perfect before we started, and now it's just... Oh, it's probably me, too. 
Who's still watching the trial? Oh my goodness! <laughs> you know, I heard a lot about the trial at Texas Roadhouse this week and I could have done without. Huh. Okay, so there's the Mary ticking banner. There's the Let's Go Ride a Bike May. There's the bunnies for the adorables. And the month to month May. Cheese. Oh. Yes, yeah, somebody, somebody asked me um, what happened to the dog. The housekeeper took the dog, Bubba, and they they oh, all they said that Bubba. Bubba was a bad boy that he would he wouldn't go back in his cage and stuff. Yep. Yeah. Would you want to? No. <laughs> well, they were shot at when they were in the cages, so no, yeah, no, no. It's terrible, terrible, terrible. All right, that's. I don't have anything. That I'm watching Brothers and Sisters again. Is what I'm watching. It's a drama. You watching anything else? Mm -hmm. You're stuck on that. Mm -hmm stuck on it. Mm -hmm. All right. We'll see you guys next week. Bye.